Hi, I'm Dr. Chris Edwards and we're going to talk today about some stretches that you can do for wrist pain and also numbness and tingling you get in your hands for when you're working at a desk too long a period or if you're doing some repetitive motions that really roll your body forward. A lot of people complain about, oh I think I'm getting carpal tunnel syndrome when they have that numbness and tinglings in their hand, but what it really is is there's a lot of tightness in through your forearms that are creating problems. And there's some simple stretches that you can do. If you do them a couple times a day, it's going to help you out a lot. Okay? The first one is you're going to extend the arm all the way out and you're going to flex that wrist up and you're just going to grab the fingers here and you're going to bend it back and you're going to hold it for 30 seconds. Now the key to this stretch is making sure that you keep your elbow straight. Because as soon as you bend your elbow like this, or any, even a little bit of a mount, you're going to start to lose some of that stretch. So keeping the elbow straight is very important. And then come back on this side and do the same thing for 30 seconds. Okay, and that's for the wrist and forearm muscles underneath the arm here. Now we go on the top, you're going to bend the wrist like this. You're going to take the thumb and place it underneath the hand, grasp the fingers over top, and you're going to bend that wrist again, and then you're going to rotate it out. And you're going to feel that stretch work right up in here. And this is where people get a lot of pain is on the outside of that elbow. And it feels really good. And if you stay consistent at that a couple times a day, probably say over a couple weeks, you're going to find a significant difference in what's going on. Now there's one more stretch I'm going to show you. And it's going to have to be right on the doorway over here. And you can use a door frame, you can use the edge of a wall to do this kind of stretch. And this is for muscles that get right up in this area because we sit on those computers and we get rolled forward. They get tight. So what we want to do is we want to bring our elbow at a 45 degree angle. If you do it down this low, it's not going to work because you're not going to hit the right muscle. So bring it on the edge of that door. You're going to stay lined up with the edge of the door. You're going to step forward with the inside foot and then just rotate your hip out. And you're going to feel that stretch right up in this area here or if we look over here, this area in here. And that's your stretching tip for today.